Following on from some of the earlier videos, we are now in a position to be able to find the limit of this sequence as n tends to infinity for any given value of x. Well, any, va any given value of x, x could be a negative number. So if x is a negative number, we've got to use this technique. Um, we remember from, our, from part 1, uh, try to find the, uh, the biggest magnitude that this could be, and then stick a, a negative in front of it. So, so from our first, um, from part 1, we uh, we can we can use this this technique on this sequence. So uh, so use the same technique on this sequence. Uh, concentrate on finding out the biggest magnitude that this could be, and then and then stick a negative in front of it. You see, biggest magnitude is when you consider the uh, the absolute value of x, and then you stick a negative in front of it. So our sequence is so always trapped in between here and the 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 big the negative version of the biggest magnitude that this could be. Well, I hope that makes sense. Um, find find the biggest magnitude that this could be, and then stick a minus in front of it. Um, and then and then from here, uh, select uh, an m such that m would be greater than than the absolute value of x. I will explain this part now. So hang on. So this thing here can be written as uh, as as this can be written as this. So I, I am now trying to explain. Um, this part here, select an m such that m is bigger than the magnitude of x. So this thing here, this thing here can be written as this. So so remember this from our from our, our previous video. We, we we created a scenario where it's nice and simple so that we could understand what's going on. So we created a scenario where x x is four, n is ten. So so when it says select an m, select an m such that m will be bigger than absolute value of x. So what what it means is this: one, two, three, four, five. Now this this is our m here. This is our m here. M here is bigger than than the absolute value of x. So so when it says I select m such that m is bigger than than uh, than x here, this integer here is bigger than this. So uh, so this is our m here. This is our m here. So this thing here. Um, well, you can imagine as, as as this thing here. So so uh, so 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 here you've got uh, one, two, and then blah 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 up to our m, up to our our m here. This is our magical m here, and then and then this will be m plus one, which is this bit here, m plus two, which is this bit here, and then all the way to uh, to uh, to n. So this is our, our m here. But then if if you look at this here. Uh, if you compare this fraction four over six, well, four over six is uh, is uh, our, our m plus one, which is five here. But m plus one, well, well, this this thing here, this thing here will be less than or equal to to uh, to our to our to to this m over uh, m sorry x over m. So so the the point here is that this this fraction here will be less than or equal to to uh, to to uh, four over m, if you like, um, uh, and then this thing here would be less than or equal to four over m, and so on. So we can say that we can say that if you want, you can say the whole thing here would be less than or equal to. Let, let's just say the whole thing here is uh, is what is it? Hang on, let me think. Um, would, would would be would be uh, hang on, let me think. Uh, th th this thing here would be let let's just say this whole box here is this box here, okay? And then and then this thing here, well, it's got to be less than uh, less than four to the power four. Sorry, it's got to be less than that. It's got to be less than this. It's got to be less than well, this one here you can match it up with this. This one here you can match it up with this. And well, it's got it's got to be less than well. Imagine this as being four over five and so on. So, so this one here matches up with this. I hope you can follow this. Um, the um, um, I'm lost for words. Let me think. I will continue in the next video.